Scientists in South Africa say they found a new human-like species that could rewrite history. Deborah Pata has the story from Johannesburg. It was a treacherous journey to recover these fossils. Some fossils there. These women were hired Hello. because they were small enough and skinny enough to slip between a narrow warren of caves at the cradle of humankind just outside Johannesburg. Is that boner? The man who directed the operation was renowned American paleoanthropologist Lee Berger. The operation itself was outrageously dangerous. Squeezing through seven and a half inch cracks, the team of cavers worked in conditions of 99% humidity. Berger has named the fossils Homo naledi, which means star in the local Sutu language, and he claims it is a new species of human relative. It's got a tiny head, an ape-like body, but arms and legs that are very, very human-like, something completely unexpected, and we found it in incredible abundance. Berger says he's identified the remains of 15 fossils, but here's what's important. He believes they were deliberately disposing of their dead in this underground chamber. Although Homo naledi is not human, Berger says, it appears to be practicing something that is uniquely human. My discovery turns science on its head. Berger is not without his critics. Some believe he's been too quick to describe this as a deliberate burial site. I'm respectful of the material that they found and I'm respectful of the efforts they made to recover it. But I'm extremely skeptical of about the interpretations. <laughs> but Berger is convinced his team have done more than enough to prove their theory. He argues this is science after all and his conclusion is merely a hypothesis, one he's sticking to until proven otherwise. Deborah Patter, CBS News, Johannesburg, South Africa. Berger, who is from Kansas, says he is not finished digging yet. He believes the site still holds even more secrets.